This is a quick tour of the WillFit streaming setup. I thought I'd show you how I've got it all connected so I stream live from Zwift on the bike or treadmill to YouTube, Facebook and Twitch all at the same time. So this is the WillFit streaming cockpit. So first off, we've got the bike on the direct drive turbo trainer, which links to Zwift software via Bluetooth. Then we've got the treadmill and that links to the Zwift software via Bluetooth using the run pod on the trainers. Swift is running on the laptop at the moment on here. Software running is Streamlabs OBS. Now that's the most important piece of software on there for streaming live to the three platforms at the same time. So this software gives you loads of funky themes like this that you can do cool stuff, loads of built-in, easy to use stuff, and actually links to YouTube, Twitch, and Facebook at the same time for streaming all three when you click go live. And then if you, it is a bit finicky to set up to begin with, but there's a number of guides on there and there's built-in themes and cool things you can use. But if you do have any questions, feel free to ask below and I'll happily answer those. Now I've got that linked up to my TV here so I can see that on the large screen when I'm on either the bike or the treadmill and see the chat, what's going on down the side. Then I can see the chat or reply via the chat on my phone, which is my little phone holder there, which I also have the Zwift companion app running at the same time. Obviously, I can reply to the chat via the microphone. So here I have the Elgato Wave 3 microphone with a sort of spit panel there for better audio quality. Now, you don't actually need that. Uh, you can actually use the built-in microphone on your laptop, but that does vastly improve the sound quality and stop a lot of the background noise. The same goes for the camera. I've got a DSLR high-quality camera set up there, which is linked up. But again, you can just use your built-in normal laptop camera for uh, streaming as well and the software will pick that up just as easy now i've also got a fan there one of the most useful things while streaming for keeping me cool the background there you can see i've got my different wattage and my different power zones have been set by my pt so it can remind me what to stick at in what zone just a little ring light there for some lighting and one of the coolest things i've got here is the stream deck setup. So this has been set up custom myself. So all these have been set up via the software and control the different screens while streaming. So I can go to the live view. So now you can see the camera there, or we can go to be right back or switch to the full camera mode. Ending, or you can hit, hit that button. It goes to a sub menu of different special effects or sounds I can play during the stream as well. And then I've got that connected via just a normal little GoPro connection. And then a little clip on here so I can switch it over to the treadmill when streaming on Zwift from the treadmill at the same time. So that is the entire setup from start to finish. If you do have any questions or you're unsure on setting it up, I'll be happy to help out or answer any of those. Just pop them below and I will reply accordingly. Hope that has been useful and thanks for watching. Check me out when I'm next live streaming on Zwift, on the bike or the treadmill. Until next time.